Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft and this episode I'm going to start start it out with an enchantment because I didn't get to do my enchantment last episode and so let's see yeah okay efficiency 4 yes that is what I wanted fortune 3 yes and I don't care about dying pick. I was going to, I was, if I was actually dying pick in case it was a little really crappy enchantment. Like silk touch, I don't care. But I've got fortune three, which I'm really happy about. Would have been also pretty nice if I had um, unbreaking, but I don't mind. Um, and I'm just going to go break all the ores I have and get extra stuff out of them. Um, so. I'll see you when I when I get to do the, doing that. Alright, so I just hopped into a creative world and about two hours later I worked out how this should work. Um, the reason it took me such a long time is because it's been a long long time since I messed around with boats, since like alpha days. Or more like beta 1.6 kind of days. That was like the last time I messed around with boats and a lot has changed. I haven't been bothered to look at the physics of boats since then and I just have been doing that. So the first design, I was thinking of doing it something like this, but I didn't really proceed because I knew it would fail. Um, and I was thinking about about um, having some water dispense over you so it would automatically eject you. 
But in the end, I came to this. Um. Yeah. I'll place down. The I'll place down two boats. So what we have here is basically you ride in to this, and there's a pressure plate. And as long as I'm on this pressure plate, these won't open. I mean, these won't go down, so the gate won't open. However, after I get off the pressure plate, there's a certain amount of time until it does open, so I have time to get off. Um, and I can even demonstrate to you that it's not just a bunch of repeaters. By showing you, uh, if I do it really quickly, same amount of time taken for it to go back. Um, and all it is is basically, um, I, don't, I don't know if you guys know about this yet, uh, it's quite new to me, I, I haven't known this for a long time, only about a month, maybe a bit more, but if you have two, two um, if you have two repeaters like that, I mean, comparators, um, what this is doing is it's sending a signal from this pressure plate to that of 13, because there's, no, 12, because there's 15 at the start, so 15, 14, 13, that gets 13, that sends out the signal of 13, then that's 14, and then, and then this gets the signal, so that's 14, that's, no, what, yeah, whatever, 14, 13, what, and it basically takes a bit of time for it, for the signal to go away, um, like, as you can see here, and that's what I just put down there, right underneath this stuff here. Um, then what I have down here is another water stream going like this. Um, by the way, the ice isn't needed. Um, there's a pressure plate here, this time with repeaters, because this is kind of stuff that needs repeaters. Um, a boat passes along here, goes goes down the pressure plate, goes on this, um, gets shot up to this, I do not need any stuff here, so I can just do this if I wanted to. And then, over here in the end is another one of these, but boat, the boat will go higher because there's no water at the level here. For some reason it didn't work here though. I don't know why. It's only got up to here, where the water is. I don't know why that did that, um, so I decided to just do it like this, and then there's the boat, again. I'll, let's see if I can show you how it all works in action. Um, I'm going to end up planting this into the world, um, in fact I already have an idea where everything's going to go. Okay, perfect. Perfect. And then there it is. Ready to go again. So, I'm just going to go back into my normal world and we'll see what happens. Alright guys, so I finished this all up and I'm fairly happy with it. it took longer than I expected to, but I had less space to work less space to work here with. And I ran into a few little problems, but let's check out how this works. I didn't hit that, did I? Nope. Um, that's what I did. Um, I recorded an intro thing for this clip just a second ago, but I realised that my microphone was switched off. Uh, because my head, my new headset works like that. I have to switch the microphone on. And here's the boat. Um, I had to raise this up by one dot because boats sink if they're in the water dead below the water. Um, my new headset is quite good actually. Um, so the new headset, um, it it cost me se it would have cost me seventy quid, but there was a fifty pound discount, so it only cost me twenty. It's a Logitech, whatever it is, and I'll probably put a link for it in the description or in the next vlog, um, which I'll probably go to upload before I upload this. Um, but let's see what else I want to do in this episode. So I finished this all up, the harder part. Um, well, 
I just need to do like a few finishing touches now. Um, so over here, I want to have kind of a beach-like thing. So I'm going to change all, most of that to sand. Uh, here, I'm going to get rid of this island-like thing and deepen the river a bit. Um, the reason you see that some stuff is deeper and some stuff isn't, the deeper things are where the actual river is. This, I believe, is just like a lake that de that naturally spawned in the river, and that's why it's like that. Um, I believe that's what it is. I don't actually know wh how that happens, but that makes most sense to me, because I've seen a lot of random stuff generating. Um, so, next I'm going to... Uh, here I'm going to dig through, through this, because this is still the river biome. And... Um... I'm going to deepen it a bit over here, and probably make it less deep here, it's just too deep, it's a bit scary. I don't like deep water for some reason, it's just, I don't know what's lurking there. Um, get get rid of this island, that, that island, um, and probably cut off a bit here. Um, I'm going to leave this area here for another beach, and I'm going to leave that island there, and... Um, past that, I haven't really worked out exactly what I wanted to do, but normal stuff. Um, I'll I'll see how much time I have left in the episode and stuff like that. But I'll get on with some work now. Um, actually, first I'll show you the boat return system. Um, because I had a little less space to work with here, um, it's not the same as it was in the first. In the original design, um, the delay on it is a bit is quite a bit shorter because um, I have less space and the comparators get a smaller amount of redstone signal. And these squid are so annoying; they go into my system all the time. So you have to kind of ride into here slowly, otherwise the boat will go on top of this block. Um, then you have like three seconds to get out. That was more like two. Um, I'll just show you the buckle here. Um, ah, great. So that's the buffer. Um, it's all controlled by a nine trap door, which opens and closes extremely fast, only letting one boat through. And now I'm going to be stuck here. Great. Oh, great. I don't have any building blocks either. Get out like this. Um, okay. Good thing I can use that. As uh, you can see, a squid must have fallen in here. Ah. Okay, I'll get out of here in just a sec. Uh huh. So, this looks a bit better now. And. Stupid builders. Sorry if you can hear some stuff, but I can't really control that, and I want to make the episode. Um, dug this out. Um, in the future, I think I'm going to move this back a bit. Um, I don't like how it's exactly a cliff. Um, but that's that, and I haven't really done anything else, and I thought I would do it with you guys, just show you how I do that. So, I want to get rid of this island, so what I do is cut down all the trees. Then after I cut down the trees, I'll level this all out, and then I'll get rid of it all. Um, like this. get rid of food. And the water should automatically go in because it surrounds it everywhere. Surrounding this island. Yeah. So the water went everywhere. Good. Um and that's the island gone. It's like it's never been here before. In the post. 
Okay. Okay, and that's that done. So I'll just get rid of this item here, and maybe a bit cut a bit off the top of that island. Um, and then that should all be done now. Um, after this, we'll check out the farm, see har harvest a bunch of stuff. Ooh, there's a cave here. Um, okay, and there's a skelly there, so I'm not going to go there. Um, I have to check that hut later. <laughs> Boom. Gone. Um, I just realised that, um, my mic is kind of, um, it's kind of quiet. Um, it's not really a problem because I, I know how to fix that, um, but sorry that I'm sounding a bit quiet in this episode. Um, all I need to do is download the program from a DVD that came from a CD. Oh, a CD ROM, yeah. Uh, that came with this headset, and I think that's where I configure it for. Um, I can't configure it by just going into my audio devices. So, um, I'm finding sounding really great like this episode, but, um, yeah, please, please, everything is okay. Um, okay, that did it. There's a crystal cool down. Um, yeah, um, my shovel isn't really dead. Uh, good thing I've got the mine thing now, so I'm going to go to that, but first, let's check out the farm. Alright, uh, this is just to be. This looks like it's ready to be harvested, apart from this little thing. Um, so let's see how this works. Um, no lag, wow. Oh, I was expecting quite a bit of lag there. I'm actually quite impressed there. Um, um, I didn't have a tool, so I didn't have a So what I need to do is put out cows on this side. I need to put the wheat here now. I, I, I realized that after I planted all the stuff. Now it was too late to really do anything. So yeah. Um, this just makes more sense to me. If it's on the same side as what I'm going to be feeding it to. Back at home, um, I I kind of want to fix this little bit here. Um, so all I all I need to do is just do this, and once the grass grows over, it's going to look so much better. I promise you guys. Um, sometime in the future, I'm going to put a proper roof on that. Um, I just need to like design one first, and. I'm just going to check the time in the episode, and I'll see how much time I have left. Alright then, looks like it's time to end the episode, so thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Whoops. Bye bye. Oh, sweet.